Former Olympic swimmer Lisa Curry, 60, has shared that she has spread some of her daughter Jamie Kenny's ashes, more than two years after her death. Curry says she chose the top of Mount Kosciuszko for the scattering as it was the closest to heaven I could get. Watch the video above, Lisa Curry reflects back on her life and the loss of her daughter for more celebrity related news and videos check out Celebrity Greater Than Greater Than Kenny was 33 when she died at Sunshine Coast University Hospital on September 14, 2020, having reportedly suffered from alcohol addiction and anorexia. Curry has said she honors her daughter by taking her ashes and dried petals from her funeral to amazing places around the country and the world. To get to the top of the NSW mountain, which is more than 2,000 meters above sea level, Curry had to hike in very challenging conditions, supported by friends. I needed something to help me find focus again and get out of bed but my main purpose was to take my daughter's ashes to the top of Mount Kosciuszko, she wrote in a lengthy Instagram post on Monday. She shared that it was the hardest thing I've ever done, and the conditions were very challenging. Plenty of snow, ice, rain, sleet, baby hail, sago, 60 to 100 km per hour winds, we had it all, she said. Once we headed out, we were committed. No turning back, one step at a time, the former swimmer said. The second day, I carried the emotion of what I was there for. I'm also on beta blockers for AF, atrial fibrillation, so my heart rate was high but the medication works to keep it down. It feels like a full body of heavy lactic acid weary, no issues at all Doc Stanton. She called the final hill a complete struggle, and said that with every step I was getting closer but couldn't see through my tears. I had an overwhelming sense of achievement and emotional anxiety with what I was about to do, Curry wrote. At the pinnacle of Mount Kosciuszko, Curry filled a purple balloon with some of her daughter's ashes and set it free. The wind was extreme, and took the balloon quickly, but it landed on the snow not far away, so, friend Glenn went and picked it up and let it go again folded hands light skin tone, she said. I honor our Jamie by taking her ashes and dried petals from her funeral to amazing places around the country and the world. Everyone has their own way of honoring those that are special to them. Fly free beautiful angel snowflake baby angel snowflake never forgotten. XXX, she ended her post. Enjoy while you have them Jamie was Curry's oldest child with ex-husband Grant Kenny. Curry is also mother to Morgan, 33 and Jet, 28, appearing on the morning show in November 2021, Curry gave advice to others who may have been touched by similar health struggles with their children. Try and get help early, try and see the red flags early, and nip it in the bud, the mother said. But I know that there are people who do make it through, I know there are people who are struggling every single day and I know there are people like Jamie who didn't make it through. So for all the parents out there who are struggling with their children's issues and mental health, I think the most important thing is just to enjoy your life with them while you have them. Watch in the video below, Lisa Curry looks to the future with the release of her new memoir, because you don't know when that last day might be. But as hard as that is, you're always on the road to try and find a way to help everyone, she went on. And I struggle with the brilliant things that humankind does in this world and yet we can't find a way to find a solution to this hideous condition. Stressing her message to others, Curry shared that there is light at the end of the tunnel, and they just have to know that life is worth living, there are so many great things to do out there to do and see. Curry recalled how her daughter wanted to write her own book about helping people in her position, but she left it too late. For more engaging celebrity content, visit 7Life on Facebook.